Yep, it's just like the title suggests, Wonder Woman 3 has been cancelled because Wonder Brothers don't know what the hell they're doing. To be fair, I don't think they ever really knew what they were doing, but they managed to please some fans at some point in time. But now, it's like they're just doing whatever the hell they want, you know? On the CW, they cancel about 17 to 20 something shows. On HBO Max, they cut like about five to seven shows. Yet they're adding asinine ideas like, hey, let's make Velma, you know, let's, let's change her skin color and her sexuality. Because for some odd reason, people really wanted that. Yet Westworld and Young Justice got canceled, but this is the show that you decide to green light. Okay, sure. Why not? Um, we don't know if there's going to be an Aquaman 3. They may sit there and decide to end the Aquaman series and make him as Lobo for some odd reason because they think that's a good idea. Um, now there's nothing they're talking about this shared universe that they're going to be doing. I'm like, bro, listen, you're not Marvel. Okay? You're not Marvel. And to, to be fair, on some level, they haven't really truly did that successfully. Not really. You look at stuff like Agent of S.H.I.E.L.D. and the Netflix stuff, and they... We're in the same universe, but they kind of, like, the shows recognize the movies, but not not vice versa, okay? For some odd reason, now they're just like, oh, we're going to make it one shared universe. The, the success in DC and they were going to do that to sit there and make, you know, like the multi, multi-universe or whatever, is that way they wouldn't get restrained like Marvel. And just to be able to tell different stories with different versions of the same character. I don't know what the hell they're doing. Okay, I have no idea what they're doing. They, You know, people complain about the Snyderverse and how things with this, that, and the third. And now you got James Gunn and this other idiot. And I'm just like, you thought it was bad before? You thought it was bad before? Wait till the crap that you're getting now. We don't even know if we're going to get a Black Adam 2. I actually like that movie. I like that movie. Um... Spoilers are at this point. Henry Cavill was in it. You know, they were since they talking about he's back. And now it's up in the air if they're going to do a Man of Steel Part 2 or not. Because for some odd reason, they thought that waiting seven damn near to ten years. What did that movie come out? Like 2013 or whatever? And it's 2023 now? What the hell are they doing? And now it's like we may or we may not get a, we may or may not get a Part 2. Flash movie, I guess is still coming out. Um, I know they're, they're going to sit there and try to use that movie to sit there and reboot everything, but I'm like, for the most part, most people like Gal Gadot, most people really like Henry Cavill, and a lot of people like Jason Momoa. What the hell are you rebooting this stuff for? This is the geniuses that they got in charge. I've been a Warner Brothers DC fan for years, and I accepted a lot of the crap that they were doing back then because most of their shows was fun to watch. Most of their movies was fun to watch. But now you got the CW, and it's turning into just a giant pile... <laughs> a, a giant pile of, of, of dog-ish, and... The movies are just in flux, and you got the people that's in charge, and this idiot, James Gunn, put out a statement basically saying, you're just going to have to sit there and wait. We're, we're, there's a lot of moving parts and stuff like that. Why? Why do we have to sit there and wait for you? There's other there's other mediums and other companies that we sit there and go to. We don't have to do anything. I can't believe this idiot made a statement talking about, you know, oh, let me read a statement again. I'm on set. So this is a quote from James Gunn. As for more answers about the future of the DCU, I sadly have to ask you to wait. No. We are giving these characters and the stories the time and attention they deserve, and we ourselves still have a lot more questions to ask and answer. That was the statement that he put out. So the statement that he put out didn't answer a goddamn thing. Just like Warner Brothers, just... All over the place. Then people sit there and wonder why, you know, Warner Brothers gets so much crap. But, you know. Anyway, you know what? 
Let me know what your thoughts are about the whole Wonder Woman thing being canceled and they may go in a different direction and they may decide to sit there and recast and apparently they think that's a good idea that is not going to work and when they fail and fall on their asses it's going to just be an amazing and glorious sight and I can't personally wait let me know what your thoughts are in the comment section below. Thank you for watching. Be safe. And I'll see you in the next video.